All right, what's up everybody? Brent here from LearnJazzStandards.com and I'm here to give you the lick of the week number 17. You can find a free PDF handout of this lick in all 12 keys at LearnJazzStandards.com forward slash lick 17, lick 17. So go there, get your free PDF handout. All right, without further ado, here's the lick of the week. All right, here with my guitar, gonna show you Lick 17, which is what I call the Ornithology Lick, which refers to Charlie Parker's bebop tune, Ornithology, which is actually a contrafact of How High the Moon. Contrafact meaning same chord changes, just a different melody put over top. So this lick, it's really just the last three to four bars of Ornithology, the melody. All right, let me play the lick for you. <laughs> Right now, what chord progression you play this over top of? Well, as the notation suggests, you can just play a chromatic passage starting from the three chord, B minor seven, and going down to the one chord, G major seven. Ornithology is originally in concert G. So B minor seven, B flat minor seven, A minor seven, A flat minor seven, G major seven. But you can also do a substitution for all those because really these are just substitutions. It would be three, six, two, Five, one. So B minor seven, E seven, A minor seven, D seven, G major seven. Really, when you have B flat minor in there and A flat minor, that just insinuates that if you were to put the six chord or the five chord, all of those tones would be altered as this lick actually suggests. But let me go really quickly over each note in this lick just so you can understand how it relates to each chord. Okay, so the B flat is a pickup note going into the B natural, which is the root of B minor seven. And then D is the flat three of the chord. F sharp is the fifth of B minor seven. Goes back down to D, and then it goes to F natural, which is the fifth of B minor seven. And then D flat is the flat three of B minor seven. And then it goes to B flat, which is the root. And then A flat is actually the flat seven, but that's the pickup into the A minor, which goes to A natural. And then it's the exact same pattern. It goes root, then flat three, then fifth, and then it goes to the A flat minor seven, and it's the fifth, the flat three, the root. And then it goes pickup, flat seven into G, which is the root, right? So pretty simple pattern there. All right, this has been the Lick of the Week. Hope you enjoyed that. Be sure to go get your free PDF handout of this lick in all 12 keys at learnjazzstandards.com forward slash lick17. Learn this lick in all 12 keys. Remember, if you haven't become part of this jazz community yet, go to learnjazzstandards.com forward slash newsletter and sign up. And be sure to be on the lookout for new episodes of the LGS podcast every single Monday at learnjazzstandards.com forward slash podcast. I'm Brent from Learn Jazz Standards. I'm signing out. I'll see you next time for the Jazz Lick of the Week.